So a couple of questions. Can everybody see? Yes. Can everybody hear me? Is this better? Yes. <laughs> Thing now that tells me that I have 
doesn't matter. And when I won't come to see you as a hospice chaplain, you don't want to see me like that. But when I do come, I never hear anyone say, I should have worked more. I should have been on social media more. Right? I never hear those things. So let's look at Mary. Same amount. Same starting place. Love God with all your heart, with all your mind, with all your soul. Love yourself. Love your neighbor as yourself, which might mean baking a pot, driving them, taking care of your neighbor. Right now, it might mean signing a petition. Taking care of those kids with quality time. Let's not just throw them breakfast. Right? Let's sit down and ask them how their day went. Let's take care of those pets. Let's love them. Let's not be distracted, right? We don't want them running in the road. We don't want them tied out in the hot weather. We want to take care of them. Who else do we want to take care of? Who's important? Friends. Friends. It's nice to do things alone, but it's nice to nurture friendships because they're going to be there when you need them. It's kind of a big rock for that one. That was a good one. <laughs> Our community. I heard the chickens out here. I know you guys are renting space, right? You're feeding spirituality in your community, right? You guys are always doing community stuff, big stone. What else you got? How about a little education? Does anybody read real books anymore? <laughs> yes. Not someone's opinion. Like a really big book. Like I'm going to learn something. Right? It's really important. Now I know somebody wants to jog or bike or do something. Hiking. It's a little stone, but. <laughs> Okay, I got two more stones. What else is really essential? Essential that you spend time with it. What is it? Contact with God. Contact with God. So we're loving him with all our heart and our mind, but we have to take an active step. Right? We gotta sit down, shut up, right? In order to hear the spirit. That takes some time. You can't do that while you're doing this. One more. This is a really big stone. Self-care self and how about planning for your future? I don't even know what that means. Does that mean global warming? Does it mean there won't be social security left? Does it mean I need a financial advisor? These are things you cannot do halfway anymore. Right? I don't even know if there's going to be a safety net. So we have to look at where we're going. I don't know what that means, but it's big. Be okay with whatever comes next. Being okay. Well, that should hopefully come in your prayer life. So now Mary's just full of big rocks, right? She's been doing everything right. She's been paying attention. God is her focus, her family, her community. Guess what the gift of God does then? Watch this. The traffic, the social media, the friends, the phone calls, the annoying parts of the kids, the annoying parts of the dog, your spouse, your relationships, all the silly stuff. And there's still room.
money, your time, and your talent. Because yeah, money comes and goes, and talent, time kind of comes and goes. But right now, with the way things are, if you do not live a merry life, you will be in the hospital. You will be taking high blood pressure pills. You will be anxious. You will be nervous because this world right now is not fun. And the only way you can do it is to focus on the big things in your life, the things that matter, the things that count, and the blessings that God continues to give. Amen.